Okay, we're just waiting for the scrub to finish. Uh, just uh, setting up braid five at the moment. So as you can see, scrubs at three percent. Whenever it gets to a hundred percent, will be done. That'll take a while. Yeah, and I ended up uh, plugging the, the big keyboard back in again. It didn't work in that uh, socket there. For some reason it won't work. Uh, but it does work in the back sockets. It's got a mouse and a keyboard at the back. It works okay in there. Uh, this one's great, but uh, when you're in the actual uh, BIOS, when the BIOS is it's reading the BIOS and setting things up, this uh, doesn't respond. That will only respond when you when you load an operating system up. So that's the downside of having this. Uh, you need a real keyboard to get into the the, uh, the BIOS settings. So just waiting on that completing. I think I'm just going to put Windows 2003 on this, 32-bit uh, of course, I'd love 64-bit but it's not going to run 64-bit. So I don't know what I'm going to do with all that extra uh, RAM that I've got, 12 gigs, I can maybe try and create some virtual machines on it or something, not really much I can do. Focus is not good. Not a lot of light in here. Summer is over. It's getting dark. Right, we'll get back to this later when we have got an operating system on it. <coughs> 